Well, the young man I'm lucky enough to introduce, uh, rather like Haley, he knew at about sort of eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, what he wanted to do. And it was to know more about coding, coding and computer science. Well, I tried to learn coding just even a year or two ago, decoding course. I lasted half a day and I came away exhausted. But I do know that it helps you to problem solve, to have a critical mind, and is very, very good for you. So what did he do? He went off to a very intensive dual degree uh, and did in both law and in um, uh, uh, computer science and passed. And he was one of the very few that did because so intensive was it, many dropped out. And he was indeed the first to pass this degree um, uh, in Arab, the first Arab in, uh, in Israel to pass this degree. So there he is, he's a, he's a um, lawyer, he's an engineer. And is he satisfied? No, he's not. Because he too has got the entrepreneurial spirit that many people here have. And he's gone on to um, come up with a, with a new concept called Loop, which will help people, children, young people in their 13, 14 year olds to learn at schools, to learn social engineering and how to do coding. Uh, already he's been invited to present at uh, Stanford University and uh, he went to this year's um, Global Entrepreneurial Summit uh, hosted by Obama and the White House in Silicon Valley. So people are recognizing him already and I commend him. He's 25, he's doing what he should do and even if he fails, he's already a success. So welcome, Wasim to Salam. If your plan is for one year, plan twice. If your plan is for 10 years, plan trees. If your plan is for 100 years, educate children. My name is Wasim Abu Salim. I am 25 years old, Arab citizen, living in Nazareth, Israel. I remember myself when I was a school kid, I always told my mother that I am realizing a lack in the education system. As a child, it didn't enable me and my friends to question things or challenge us to think out of the box. This issue really bothered me through the years and sought to make some change in the system. Think about it. The place which is supposed to teach kids how to take chances makes us sometimes fear from the unknown. Instead of being creative, the old education system is limiting our mind. It made us believe that thinking creatively could be wrong or seems weird to others. Back at age 13, I really wanted to learn coding and computer science. And unfortunately, I found no help or guidance. In Israel, such computer science classes are taught only at age 16 in few schools. So, in order to, uh, to exercise my right and receive such education, I had only one option, which is traveling far from my hometown, Nazareth, and participate in such courses taught in Hebrew, not my mother tongue language, which is Arabic. That period was the defining moment in my life. I knew that I had to find a way to head the next generation who may face the same problem as I faced at their age. And help them unleash their hidden potential. So my journey began. I attended university and became the first Arab to complete a unique dual degree program of computer science and law. Knowing that being a computer engineer and a lawyer will definitely help me create the solution. And last year, it happened. I founded Loop the first and only social initiative in Israel, giving every school kid aged 7 to 16 the opportunity to learn how to code through mentorship-based model and personalized education. Unlike groups of 25 students with a teacher in a class, we offer groups of 12 students with four mentors with content adapted to what the student as an individual is interested to learn. So for example, a child who is interested in developing a mobile app will learn to develop an app. And another child who wants to develop a website will do that by the end of the course. In six months, we have successfully reached over 500 school kids from four different cities, giving them the opportunity to learn how to code through online games and free software designed for this purpose. Still, we have a lot of work to do. 
In Israel, there are 1.7 million children at age 7 to 16. So imagine how many of them are interested to learn coding and looking for such assistance. At Loop, the computer science university students, in return for their mentorship, receive scholarships to pay for their university tuition fees. These mentors share their knowledge and help the next generation to develop the next big ideas for the community, by the community. And the great thing is that the 12 years old child will become a mentor after 10 years, and he or she will also be mentoring their following generations to become part of the loop. Loop aims to transform students and children from being passive tech consumers into engaged creators. Our task as young leaders is to offer modern education to children so they can face the unknown future. And that's why I would like to invite all of you who are specializing in education to become part of the loop. Thank you.